Yo, what's up, what's up? I told you, man, I am trying so hard, man, to make this poetry interesting. But also, you know what I mean? I mean, you know what I mean? When you write about your life and what you think, it's so easy to do this. Well, at least to me. And, like, you got to appreciate some kind of art. Like, you know, it's so crazy because... Uh, you know, I used to have a, a girlfriend of mine used to call me a thuggish, ruggish nerd. You know, I'd be out there in Brooklyn, running the street, boy, and fly home for Jeopardy. Still do it to this day. I'm trying to tell you, man. Yo, yo so no matter where you're from, man, you have traits. And sometimes, man, it's better to take your traits on the road. <laughs> It really is, but you always know where you're from. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm going to tell you something. This is straight up, man. I don't claim to be no hood Negro, but I'm from the hood Negro. <laughs> Orchard Park, Roxbury, Massachusetts, Boston, City of Champions. I learned what I learned and did what I did because of them. I guess I didn't know any other way to do it. I thought drugs was the avenue, so I stood on my stoop, on my street, on the bumpy roads, and sold chums. And now I can speak of my dumb. My mother named me Lamont, the mountain. And that's what I wanted, the top of it. To me, every letter of my name meant something. To me, self-proclaimed celebrity, but for real, nobody knew me, except an OP. That's when I realized, a brand new me? In different cities? I already know how to save. Now it's time for me to make some money. So I flexed. I stopped the drug thing. Did different things. I'm an opportunist. I did the unexpected. I told you, I miss my former days of being economically independent. Every day, payday. Little money or bigger money, but always money. And I ain't always need it. That's probably why I was so good at saving it. It's easy when you got more money than you need. But I was greedy or hungry. Check the etymology. Are they synonyms? Nevertheless, that was me. See, because I love my projects, my friends, my family, and deep down inside, I know my intentions were authentic. But even back then, I was thinking about this very minute. So I wasn't cheap. I was saving so I can have something when I'm 48 and writing. I guess I apologize. But if you didn't hear about my repentance to the Supreme Judge, I'll show you a stamp receipt. (laughs) my presence that's why i flex i've been stopped the drug thing i did different things i'm an opportunist so i did the unexpected thing i told you i missed my former days of being economically independent and you have to realize it's all relevant in reference to the taken listen to the metaphoric no more jumps for me weight or nothing and i was cool with nothing Because I was always going to get something. Plus, my motto is never leave with nothing. Money is the goal. There is no other option. Even in my small caption, it's reading same thing. Money is the goal. No obstacle. No failed mission. But sometimes my means were unnecessary. So I stay repenting. That's exactly why I flex. I've been stopped the drug thing. I did different things. I'm an opportunist. So I did the unexpected. And I told you, I miss my days of being economically independent. Peace. Creation back. Tell you, man, we gotta get this computer so I can do this shit. I was thinking this is funny.